what's up guys welcome to a video of islands and yeah um i mean i got the trolls off camera it's just good at least i got something off camera but i also see a bee over there in the distance i'm just gonna collect my own just first cheese maker what the heck is a cheese maker i guess it's gonna make cheese all right so this is the farm right now and here's the farm now yeah um pretty good but before we do anything else i want to discuss something um you remember in the last episode i said yeah i was just gonna buy this pink sticky gear but the pink sticky gear cost one million dollars yeah i know that is expensive so that's why i am just going to kill those pink slimes for the pink sticky gear until i get that i don't know how i'm gonna get it but i will get it and also um let me just see is there a steel rod recipe that i can maybe find here let me just see butterfly lanterns that's new i don't see any steel rods okay i see here um a steel mill does i converts iron into steel so maybe that's how you get steel ingots i'm gonna read the other ones produce copper cage copper drill automatic that in extracts from resource deposit islands powered by coal hmm i don't know how do you get steel rods i'm gonna find out real quick how do you get steel rods okay so the steel rod isn't actually in the workbench tier 3 it's actually in the anvil but i don't know where i put my anvil oh never mind i found the anvil yeah here it is we need steel ingots i was right it has to do something with this so well, i'm just gonna get some steel ingots real quick so we need 20 steel ingots to get one rod so that means um wait how wait oh man okay let me just go to the workbench tier 3 real quick all right how much this oh okay i think i'm gonna get a conveyor first well actually no i mean let's save eight steel rods so we can get the um the uh, industrial smelter actually we're gonna need 10 so 20 times 10 so that means we're gonna need 200 iron we're gonna have to smelt that iron and then we're gonna have to turn that iron into steel rods i mean into steel ingots using the blast furnace which luckily i got okay luckily the blast furnace is actually useful i'm also just gonna get um an extra 40 iron to get um the iron sword so i can fight the mobs there because yeah it's pretty useful i guess we're gonna get iron um oh yeah wait i almost forgot cue the time lapse all right i actually have enough right now all right it's time to get smelting boys and oh wait are there still iron ingots inside of here i mean i guess i did leave some of these to like um stay so yeah there were some iron ingots inside of here that was really interesting and weird i don't know why but why is carrots here maybe you can make baked carrots i don't know I'm starting to doubt that though that would be kind of disgusting i mean are carrots usually baked no this can't be <laughs> all right guys the stone sword has officially get go gone out of the stone sto sword is probably now in retirement because now it has a rivalry the stone i mean the um iron sword and i don't plan on using that stone sword again like ever 
Yeah, I know can mean, but who cares to be honest? I mean, it's a stone sword. Nobody uses it. And I used to use it, which is kind of embarrassing, actually, thinking about it. Wait, how many um, iron can you actually put inside of the blast furnace? Because I am not making more blast furnaces, okay? I'm just telling you that. Okay, that much. You can open this? Nobody ever told me that. Alright, this iron totem is actually really good. Okay, you know what? I need more grass. I mean, I could get a clay totem, to be honest, but... Hmm, should I get a clay totem for 10k? I mean, 10k isn't really that much anymore for me, so... I think, yeah, I think I'm gonna get a clay totem, because I think I might need more blast furnaces. But, hmm, do I, though? You know what? Fine, I'll get a clay totem. Well, I'm, all, I'm also gonna sell my, um farming things i don't really like farming anymore because my farm is just way too big like seriously it's just way too big so that's why i'm not gonna continue my farm anymore unless i need like money then yes i will but i don't really need any money right now i have 17,000 coins and it's gonna take me a trillion years to get to 1 million so yeah that's why i am not farming anymore I mean, I don't get a lot of, um, m coins from farming, just farming isn't very enjoyable now. Just use the stone sickle to, yeah, it's not really enjoyable. Sorry. Oh yeah, now, uh, this is my first 20k coins. So, noticing, I, for I forgot to tell you guys about some, the crate of wheat costs 840 coins i mean sells for 840 coins and there's a crate packer i'm buying that i'm buying a crate packer oh my god i clicked q oh my goodness luckily i'm not in a uh, public server or, or else that would have just fell phew okay i'm gonna buy a clay totem I know who would want to buy a marble totem. That means you're a bit special than everybody and also a bit dumb. Well, like right now, I have 121 coins, but I want to uh, get the uh, um, more grass. So yeah, I'm going to be doing this uh, farming. So yeah, that's why I farm. All right, let's go to the um, Cletus person and sell our stuff here which is a thousand coins of wheat and other stuff so this should get us to like 2k which is good i like that okay we're way over 2k coins we're in like 3k coins just from one harvest we got basically 3000 coins that is absolutely insane like seriously well, let's go to our good guy, Jack, and view the shop, and buy grass, if I can even find grass. Ah, uh -huh, here it is. Is 100 seriously the limit? Can you not, like, oh, you can. 5,000 coins? Nope. Okay, so I think this is enough? No, it's not. Okay, I'm gonna buy 500. 150 i think that okay there we go all right okay there we go and i'm gonna buy four more grass and there we go i i can i purchased 564 grass and i only have one coin left which is kind of bad if you ask me that means i'm poor poor like a goblin okay i'm not a goblin guys i'm just gonna put grass here just in case we want to farm but i'm not farming just yet so all right so we're gonna have all this new farming space to put our farms in and oh my goodness i have a tulip i haven't gotten a tulip yet whoa this one's exotic because that one's pretty rare maybe i don't know actually maybe it's really common and i'm just super unlucky and i never got it before but um i don't think that's the case I guess I'm just gonna put this here for now and oh you need a hundred wheat to make a crate ok 
Okay. Okay, I think this is done. Yeah, these are done. 66 iron ingots and 103 iron ingots. And there we go. And I got... Oh, wait. That wasn't enough. Oh, the coal goes so much faster here. Oh, no. That means you're going to need 450 coal. I need a coal totem. Okay, I don't need a coal totem. But let's just farm some coal real quick. I'm going to expand the platforms to so clay can spawn okay let's get some coal i don't have a coal totem but that's fine anyways i'm just gonna go mine some coal real quick so cue the time lapse We have enough coal, so let's get the heck out of here and go back to the base and melt some steel rods. Alright, this is still cooking. Okay, more iron and some more coal. Alright, let's just wait for this to cook up. Alright guys, I also got a stone totem. I mean, um, a coal totem now. Which is pretty cool. And I also got this daisy over here. Which is also pretty cool. Alright. I have 200 steel ingots. So this should be enough. And I also have noticed, yes. There are gold steel rods. I'm pretty sure, yep, they're used to make these. But, we've done it. I think we can make 8. Alright. Oh, my calculations were way off. Okay. Now we have eight steel rods. Now the only thing that we need, okay, I don't want to do this, is the pink sticky gear. Oh no! First of all, a pink a pink slime spawning is already very rare, and the chance to get a sticky gear from it is only ten percent. So this is gonna take a while. Like seriously, like this is gonna take maybe an hour. So, okay, I know this wasn't the goal of the mission, but I mean, that's a pretty big blue slime. Okay. All right, guys, we have found the target. Here it is. The pink slime, and it's only been five minutes. No, we didn't get the sticky gear. This is absolutely outrageous. No. Okay, just after I killed that slime, another pink slime just spawned. What are the chances of that? Oh my goodness. Oh my god. What are the chances? And I didn't get another sticky gear. Well, I mean, that's fine, I guess. Oh my goodness. I can't believe they spawned two times in a row. How rare is that, guys? Oh my flipping goodness. You guys can see. Oh my goodness. The pink sticky gear. It's right here in our hands. <sighs> that took one hour of continuous grinding. But it was worth it, folks. I got the pink sticky gear. And we got... Um, let's see. Can we craft it? The industrial smelter. Oh my goodness. Holy moly, yes. Finally, okay, we got the industrial smelter. Now, I was saying last time that my calculations were wrong. Well, I wasn't wrong. I actually need two more because you guys know why. We need the, um... Yeah, we need them because of the we need them for the conveyors these things. Okay, um yeah, and I also can make a slime portal sharp. Um wait, what? I'm sure I guess what? Okay. I have a slime portal. Wait, does this just teleport me? It does just teleport me right here. Okay, this is gonna be pretty useful I think. So that's why I'm gonna um, put some grass near it because it looks better like this, okay? Anyways, oh my goodness, a lot of flowers have spawned because there are some flowers here and there. 
Um, I'm just gonna go smelt some iron real quick, and yeah, I think that's gonna be it. We're just gonna need 10 more iron, and I wanna see if this industrial smelter works or not. First of all, we're gonna have to break the iron totem, which is kinda sad, but that's fine. I mean, I can afford another iron totem really easily. Oh my goodness, you guys don't know how long that took me. And we also need to get the coal totem as well. Geez, I two shot these coal things. That's actually really cool. Anyways, the dumb cow update. Okay, now we just need to wait for this. So in the meantime, um, I don't really know what to do in the meantime. But, um, I guess I'll remove this. Boop, 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 boop. Stone is getting destroyed. Stone is getting destroyed. I mean, this does look kind of cool, I guess. Alright. Um, and yeah, um, not to mention, I have 38 green sticky gear. I, I don't know why, I only have one blue sticky gear. And I got, um, uh, yeah. This is the industrial smelter, guys. Oh my goodness. Do you see how good... This took me one hour to get. To, to be honest, this took me two hours to get. So, yeah. After ten pink slimes that I killed, only one of them dropped that. Oh my goodness. What am I doing with my life? Why do I do this to myself? Like, seriously. I don't know why but anyways enough chat talk let's grab the uh, I mean let's craft this all right I have our good old conveyor belt and I think you put it here okay so to make sure that this is right let me just see if I just put you can't drop stuff oh, man I guess we're gonna have to use that and that. Let's see if um, this works or not. I'm gonna put some coal in here. Can you put coal in here? No, you can't. Well, I guess I think I think this is how it works. I'm pretty sure this is how it works. And I also have a thousand stone. Wait, I saw an iron go in there. Yeah, there is an iron inside of here and. There's the coal. Oh, it just does like this. Okay, well, it doesn't instant smell, but it does smell a lot faster. And do have one over here. Okay, this is really cool. I like this. I like this. Okay, okay. So there's nothing in there currently. Um, I'm gonna put that there. Oh wait. Okay, this in this one you can actually um three come out. Oh my god, that is useful. This this is actually so good. It's so much better. Okay. So let me just grab um I mean craft another one of these. I think I might I think I need yeah, I need three more, but I mean we did it, we got the industrial smelter. Okay, I'm gonna add some more stuff to the industrial smelter soon, but I'm gonna do that off camera. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed, hit that like button, um, subscribe, I'm trying to hit 100 subscribers. That would be pretty cool if we hit 100 subscribers, and oh my goodness, look at these conveyors. But anyways, see you guys in the next episode.